Hi there, this is Kenny Powers, YouTube, and today we're going to be cracking another vintage box of cards. Today we're going to be doing 1985 Topps Baseball. In this set, contained four of the hottest rookies to hit the market uh, for the in, in the mid-80s. Doc Gooden, Mark McGuire, Kirby Puckett, and Roger Clemens. Uh, in 1985, uh, this set was destined for greatness, and a lot has happened since then. Uh, now, these cards can be had for pretty cheap. Um, uh, I think scandal is the best word to describe this set and its rookies. So, uh, I'm going to be doing a four-part uh, break. We're going to do nine packs apiece. My first video got a little long with the Upper Deck break, 1989 Upper Deck. Uh, it went over 30 minutes. This one we're going to try in four-part series. I'm going to do top right, top left, bottom left, bottom right, nine packs at a time, four vids. Um, thanks for watching. I appreciate it. We're going to be shooting for those four names I mentioned. Uh, well, actually, just the three. Puckett, Clemens, and McGuire. I have never opened uh, any 1985 before. Uh, I was six years old when this came out. Um, I don't think I was buying cards yet. So this is um, a neat little um, treat for me to crack something that's um, uh, so old. So um, without further ado, we are going to... Crack this box. I just got it in the mail today. It was fresh from a case, according to my seller. Uh, I got it on eBay for, I believe it was with postage, $80 ship. So, uh, you know, we'll see what we find. And like the uh, 89 Upper Deck uh, box I cracked, um, it's just fun opening them, you know, reliving some uh, old memories and, you know, just getting that card firsthand. I know I could go buy it for five, ten bucks, but I kind of want to get it out of a pack. So here we go. We're going to do the top left nine packs. 1985 tops. So without further ado, let's rock and roll. Sweet pack. Look at that. Gum pack. Uh huh. Yeah, baby. Look, check that out. Yeah, this McGuire rookie was like the hottest thing since sliced bread when he, um, oh nice, the first card, check that out, it's a Dwight Gooden record breaker, but it's the, it's the wax card, anyway, uh, let's see what we got here, John Tudor, there's an Olympic card, but not my McGuire, it's Scott Bankhead, Bill Russell, the Vuk, Bob McClure, Lee Smith, Hall of Famer, Randy Lurch. And some silly send in winner card. I think my chances are pretty much zero since the expiration date is probably passed. Tug McGraw, father of Tim McGraw, the country music star. Kind of interesting. Yeah, these are cool, but you can see they're all, as you can see, they're all, the centering is, oh my gosh. Who knows what was going on back then? There's a lot of, to find a, a good card and to have it uh, grayed out properly. Good luck. So one pack down, and the gum. Whatever. The old wax. Yeah, you can. So now I know what everybody's talking about. That top card where the wax seal was was done, has a huge wax stain on it. So we're just gonna throw that off to the side. And then the back card has the, has the gum stuck to it. So we'll just put that one off to the side as well. Greg Booker, Bill Madlock, Ozzy, my childhood idol, Burt Blylevin, Hall of Famer, Mike Bodica, not to be confused with Clarence Bodica. Len Barker, Wayne Krenchicki, Sixto Lescano, Jeff Dedman. Yeah, that's a cool Henderson card. Uh-oh. Oh. Oh. Yeah. Ricky. Ricky loves some Ricky. Man. That guy, I tell you. Ricky Henderson. I don't know what to think about Ricky Henderson. I don't even... Who, who cares? All right. Third pack. Oh, this... That looks like it's got kind of a weak seal. Hmm. I'm not sure what to think of that, but whatever. I can only imagine how many of these boxes were searched in 1985, or uh, uh, when McGuire was going for the record. 
I can only imagine how many were uh, searched. That card was like worth hundreds of dollars. So, anyway, checklist. John McNamara, Dave Owen, Arginus Salazar, Roy Smith, Frank Pastor, Jack Percante, Rusty Staub. Oh, Rusty Staub. Any Urban Dictionary fans? Go to Urban Dictionary and put in Rusty Staub. You'll laugh your ass off. Luis Aguayo, John Wathen, Tom Brookins. Tom Brookins had a popular error card in the 1989 Fleer set, I believe. I'm not sure what the error was, but it was a big deal. Tim Rock Reigns, kind of a cool card. All right, cool cards. I think it was the last attractive year, in my opinion, for 19 uh, for, for for tops baseball, at least when I was a kid, because '86 got just ugly. Okay, Tim Belcher, number one draft pick. Check that out. Sweet glasses, man. God, what a stud. Those are like the, when you walk outside, they turn they turn dark, and when you go inside, they turn light. Man, not a very flattering picture. Ralph Hulk, old manager. Jim Corcoran, Terry Foster, Alan Bannister. Mike Paliarulu, UL Washington. Willie McGee. Donnie Scott, Al Nipper. Billy Gardner. And Mike Scott. He was a Cy Young Award winner. <laughs> Uh oh yeah, these look I don't know about that seal. It almost looks shady. I don't know about that. Hmm. You know what? May never know. May never know. Gum. Yeah. Mike Lacoste, Paul Owens, another great set of glasses. Greg Gross, my lord. Buddy, Dean Kalana, Don Robinson, John Henry Johnson, Bob Dernier, Dave Stapleton, bunch of bums. Ha, <laughs> yeah. Sweet. Old baseball cards, man. Fun, fun, fun. These aren't... The gum isn't really leaving too much of a stain that I thought it would. Which has me concerned that maybe... I don't know. Okay. Best name in all of sports. Right there. Rusty Kuntz. I bet he never got teased. Brian Harper. Keith Cato. Hey, this guy kind of looks like uh, the catcher for the Braves, Brian McCann. Check that out. Yeah, a little bit. Mike Young and Steve McMahon. Wow. Just a whopping, whopping nine packs of superstars. I know a lot of people, when they don't get something in a box that they are looking for, they'll claim that it's searched and... Blah, blah, blah. Uh, you know, I don't know. If I don't know, I don't know. So. Charlie Moore, Brewer. Okay, here's the Dwight Gooden rookie card. That card was big pimpin' back in the day. And it actually is perfectly centered. Um, it doesn't look to have any real damage on it. But I don't know. Bill Connell, Chris Spire, Mike Sosha, Gene Richards, Bobby Cox, sweet, Richie Hebner, Pat Zachary. Two packs left for video number one. Uh, this video, I'm opening nine packs of 1985 Tops Baseball. Mike Witt, Ron Washington, current manager of the Rangers. 
Dennis Eckersley, Hall of Famer, John Franco, Molitor, Brewer fan favorite, Bob Clark, oh yeah, Rupert Jones, Butch Weiniger, Rich Gossage. Got some Hall of Famers in that pack. And pack number nine. Let's get it over with. Yeah. Mark Gubaza, Jimmy Slayton, Tony Armas, John Candelaria, White Herzog, Hall of Famer, Bob Horner, John Lowenstein, Carmen Castillo, Frank White, Larry Milborn, Dave Bergman, Doug DeSinses. Well, there it is. Nine packs down, a quarter of the box, and the only card worth a damn was the Dwight Gooden rookie that I pulled. And too bad it's 2013 and not 1985 when Doc Gooden was flat-out dominant. So, videos two, three, and four coming up. Thanks for watching.